what's popping everyone it is your girl name should be and welcome back to the channel so in today's video i am going to be doing the holiday tag i want to tag a couple badass small youtubers like myself the very first one that i want to tag is my girl yusinda martinez the second one is my girl larice lifestyles and then finally my girl lele shots so make sure you follow all of my girls they are small up and coming youtubers like myself all the information will be in the description box be sure to like this video give it a big thumbs up and leave a comment down below and make sure you tell the girls that they should be sent you without any um further ado let's get straight into this holiday tag i'm gonna answer some questions for you guys regarding the holiday season and hopefully you guys like them keep in mind that i am a veteran so majority of my holiday experience has been away from family so i seem like i am not in a holiday spirit it's just because i am traumatized but yeah let's get straight into this video i got my handy ipad i i have my handy ipad right here and that's why we're pulling up the questions on so if you see me looking down then that's exactly what i'm doing and of course princess is running around so hopefully she don't interfere in our video so question number one is how do you celebrate Christmas? So honestly, I really just celebrate Christmas in the bed. I normally, I am normally not around family, so I may have a few presents to open from my friends or my boyfriend, but other than that, I'm in bed. I normally don't even get up. I don't even get dressed. I may have some breakfast, but I never have like a Christmas dinner, like none of that. And I'm honestly, I don't be sad about it. So question number two is, how are you spending this Christmas? So honestly, this Christmas should be fairly different for me. For the first time, in my, I'm in my brand new house, so that is a plus. I still, um don't have any holiday decorations but i've just been having a lot going on with moving in and i know everyone can relate when you're moving you're so busy there's so much to do i just haven't had the time to do decorations but next year i got myself but like i said this year should be different because right after christmas i am going to see my family and i'm so excited and i should be bringing in a new year with them so hopefully that starts the next year off um, more of a family oriented vibe because I see my family the least amount um, of time throughout the years and this year has been no different. And even with COVID not around, I still don't see my family as much as I would like to. Hopefully by me bringing in the new year with them, I spend more time at home. So question number three is, are you good at buying for others? I messed that all up. <laughs> Are you good at buying gifts for others? I am very good at buying other people gifts. However, I do rarely buy gifts for other people. I normally just buy gifts for my nieces and my nephews, my parents, and then um, the person I'm dating. And that's really about it. Mm, I take that back. Sometimes I buy gifts for my best friend and then my god son. I don't know how I forgot about them too. But I do buy really good gifts. Um, I like good things, so I tend to buy other people good stuff because I want that in return. So question four, what is your most memorable Christmas memory? So um, bringing in the holidays with my grandparents was honestly the best memories that I had because we was always in the holiday spirits. We always decorated. I had my sisters there and my daddy would come over and we would all open up our gifts. And I just used to be, I just remember being so happy and so excited. So I definitely miss my grandparents. Rest in peace, grandpa, grandma, I love you forever. Keep looking over your girl. Um, I hope you guys can see my little elf ears. I should sit back, huh? Okay, I'll sit back and you guys can see it better. Okay, so next question. Um, how did you spend last Christmas? I didn't do anything last Christmas. I chilled in the bed, me and Princess, and watched television, and that was about it. So question six, on Christmas Eve, what do you leave out for Santa? Now y'all know I'm too old to be believing in Santa. Um, so definitely don't leave nothing out for Santa. So next question is, what is your favorite holiday movie? And I, I love how, how the Grinch stole Christmas. And no, I am not a Grinch at all. 
But I just think the movie is hilarious and it just goes to show how much of a um, tis the season type of holiday Christmas is because no matter what the Grinch did, he cannot take the spirit away from those kids, from those parents. And so I just love, love, love that movie. Um, next question is, what is your favorite holiday song? Yeah, I'm going to have to go with um, Mariah Carey, All I Want for Christmas. I love that song. Like, I love her whole little holiday um, album. I'm just going to say that. Like, I just love it. That's my favorite song. Definitely for Christmas. We are on question nine now. What do you eat for Christmas Day? What do you eat for Christmas Day? What do you eat on Christmas Day? <laughs> okay, so um, like I told you guys, normally I don't eat anything because I'm in the bed, I'm alone. But if I had a choice of what I want to eat for Christmas Day, it's definitely going to be like some macaroni and cheese, some yams, some ham, and maybe like some green beans or something like that. But yeah, that, that definitely tastes so good right now. But yeah, definitely what I would want to eat for Christmas Day. So next question is, what do you have? What do you have? No, this definitely reads, what do you have in the Christmas Eve traditions? So I believe they want to ask, um, do I have any Christmas Eve traditions? And no, right now I don't, but next year I definitely want to incorporate some. Okay, so next question we are on is question 11 and it says do you wear christmas jumpers if so show us a picture and uh, the answer is no i do not and a christmas jumper if you guys don't know is basically just a christmas sweater so next question is in your culture what day do you receive gifts on christmas day show us your christmas decorations I have an empty living room. My funny trick being delivered today though, so don't judge me. Question 14, do you like eggnog? No, <laughs> I haven't tasted it yet though, but I'm gonna taste it this year. Question 15, have you ever visited the North Pole? No, really? No. <laughs> Question 16, what was your favorite gift you received on Christmas? Hmm. You know what? I honestly do not know. So it must have been a really great gift that I received. But um, I'm just trying to see. What did I get last year? I don't know, guys. I don't know. Like, I always get really good gifts. But I get so much stuff throughout the year that I can't really remember what is what when I got what. So... I don't remember what I got for my birthday this year. So yeah, I'm not sure. Question 17 is, have you ever gone Christmas caroling? I hope I said that right. No, I can't sing. And I have never had anyone knock on my door either, but I was in an apartment. So maybe this, maybe I will get some for now on. I don't know, we'll see. Question 18, have you ever built a gingerbread house? No. I have not built a gingerbread house. I was going to do Vlogmas this year and do it on one of the Vlogmas days, but with moving and everything, I really didn't have enough time to do it. So I definitely want to build a gingerbread house. Maybe with my guys and we can do um, that activity together. I think that'll be extremely fun for me and him. Um, we are going to skip a couple of these questions because I will be here all day. <laughs> um, is your Christmas tree fake or real? Like I said, I don't have a Christmas tree, but I would definitely get a fake one only because I don't want, um, I don't like the smell of the real Christmas trees with uh, that along with the bugs and stuff. Yeah, I'm totally fine with a fake Christmas tree. Um, who cooks Christmas meal? In my household, it's only me and Princess and I don't make any Christmas um, meal. It's not that... I don't know how to cook everything, but I can do a little something in the kitchen. But if I wanted to make a Christmas meal, I think I can do it successfully. I'll just say that. So next question is, what gifts do you want for Christmas this year? I really have a lot of things that I want for Christmas. I was thinking about doing a little um, Amazon wish list type of video. So if you guys 
want to see something like that then let me know let me know down in the comments but i think out of everything that i really want for christmas i am going to go with a i want a vanity honestly i want a vanity um i don't really wear a lot of makeup but i do want to get into it so i feel like if i buy myself a vanity and start getting makeup and all that other stuff then i wouldn't have any choice but to play around with it and eventually get really good at it so i would say that i want a vanity and that is what i really want for christmas this year so next question is what would be your dream place to spend christmas now even though christmas is all about you know cold weather and snow and all that other stuff i would definitely want to i will always want to spend my christmas any day of the year in some warm weather on the beach in a bikini so um anywhere like that for me for christmas is perfectly fine <laughs> don't judge me you guys i do not like the cold i get cold extremely fast i have low arms so no no thank you um next question or are you a last minute shopper or are you organized? So I'm a Virgo and I like to pride myself on being organized, well prepared for everything. But as far as Christmas shopping, yes, I am a last minute shopper or an Amazon shopper and just get it delivered straight to you. So yeah, that is me. Okay guys, so this is going to conclude this video. I hope you guys enjoyed my holiday tag. I hope you guys check out the three small YouTubers that I tagged in this video as well. Be sure to go check out their channel, subscribe, let them know that I sent you over there. Um, be sure to subscribe to my channel. Leave me a comment down below if you enjoy watching this video and if you can relate to me on any of the questions or any of my answers. And um, I will look forward to seeing you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.